launching that one up high, letting the wind bring it in a little left to right. Also a short second shot, just 70 yards. Trying to throw a dart up there. Yep, actually kept it below the hole, good positioning. Really good opportunity here, uphill, slight right to left break. Maybe a little more than slight. There's a close association uh, with the ShopRite LPGA Classic K. They gave for a sponsor invite back in 2015, so it's been a long... Quick here down the hill. The first five or six feet, once it gets on the green, is straight down the hill. Then it flattens out a bit. Oh, okay. nicely done. It was a year ago that she... A year ago this week that she went left hand low. On the hill there. Here's... Slow mo of Brooks swing. Let's watch how far past parallel she takes it. Not too bad with a little bit of a shorter club, the hybrid. To There's that false front where if it doesn't quite carry it on the green, it doesn't bounce up. It's just, it did pick up a little bit. Oh gosh, you carried it. And a release Perfect down. Distance. It's right on the edge. Oh no, it's going to stay up there. Tom, a a turtle scooted across the green as this group approached. He was checking out the whole location and the read of Brooks' putt. I think uh, taking a three on this hole each and every day would be very satisfactory. One of the most generous tee shots. Typically though, Kay, when it's windy, playing into off the left. Not that way today. No, just a half a club wind, and Brooke is top 10 in total driving. Loves her driver. A strong couple of years. That was in the fall. And that's just a lob wedge. Trying to get some good spin on it. Didn't get any spin on that. Have to control the distance. Oh. Much mud on the ball. Little right to left breaking putt. Her speed control looks really good today. Definitely goes to a familiarity and a comfort level around this golf course, having seen it so many times and certainly had success here. And Brooke in perfect position off the tee, gonna walk away with a double. First double bogey of the day at nine.